we keep a moment of remembrance and respect, honouring Sir David Amis, the Honourable Member for South End West, colleague and friend. A moment of silence for the passing of the former Member of Parliament for South End West, Sir David Amos, who was tragically murdered at a constituency surgery in Leon Sea. In an active stand against this act of terrorism and to connect with the public at a time of healing, Members of Parliament have reached out to local communities to continue the time-honoured tradition of the MP surgery within their local constituencies. One such event was recently held at the Fuzzle Mosque by the Member of Parliament for Putney and friend of the Ahmadiyya Muslim community, Fleur Anderson, who held the first MP surgery within the mosque grounds to connect and support her constituents. So I'm looking forward to meeting uh, many members of the mosque that have come here today on this blessed Friday and I know that many people have booked in their times to come so it may be something they want me to stand up for in Parliament and, and ask the government for. It may be a local issue to do with housing or education for their children and I'll spend time with each of them um, and to see what I can do to help each one of them. It's a good opportunity for the members of the community to come ask questions, uh, for her to present them in, in, in the parliament and, and specifically for, for, for her to organise her surgery here at you know, a very historical uh, location which is the Fuzzle Mosque. Since its opening in 1926, the Fuzzle Mosque has been a landmark in the City of London as the first purpose-built mosque within the city. Throughout its history, the mosque has hosted many local council members, members of parliament, faith group leaders, as well as members of the Royal British family, cultivating a relationship between the community and governing bodies to show loyalty to the country and spreading the peaceful teachings of Islam. This report is brought to you from MT International, UK Studios in London.